Here we are, folks. Here we are again, Derby Herbie. It's the one! The only Derby News! I'm JT Money. And I'm here! By now, all of you know that Frank Kickman was the winner of the Hit of the Year contest. That's right, what a hit it was. And to prove furthermore that he was the honorable recipient, Frank has decided to go ahead and donate those prizes to a deserving rookie. This is a righteous deal for you rookies out there. Frank, you are the man. The man. So, what we need is for you people to send in your videos of why you think you deserve Frank's prize. That's right, or if you actually know somebody you think is deserving, you can send it in about them also. Bam! Just remember, keep it short and to the point. Period. Bam! And maybe show us, uh, you know, what tank and uh, what little battery box we're using at this time. Whatever it is, keep the video short and to the point. And uh, so when you do, just send your entries to Booze Brothers at bbdn.com. That's right. Just whatever you do, make it count because this will not happen ever again. I guarantee it. Most likely never. March 26th is the deadline for your video deadline and the award will be announced in our April show in Germany and it's right here. You know Frank, uh, you're a good man for doing this. This is pretty cool. Uh, Frank, I gotta hand it to you dude. This one's for you. That's the next one. Here we go. <laughs> Ah! Speaking of a good man, let's get rid of Larry. <laughs> no, uh, actually, that was just uh, that was just part of the skate. We're not really getting rid of Larry. No, no, I'm just kidding. Let's go to Larry with the National Derby Driver Recognition. Larry. Larry. Thanks, sir. And JT, sorry to bust your balls, but I'm not going anywhere. The show is nothing without me. I know you think it's you, but it's not. It's me. I'm Larry. I'm Sarah. And this is NDDR. This month, we recognize Corey Paro Sr. from Sandy Creek, New York. Corey's been a mechanic for 20 years, married for 22 years, and has been a derby driver for 27 years. Now there's a man who's not afraid of commitment. He and his wife Lori have two sons, Corey Jr. and Evan. Who both participate and hold their own in the arena. When Corey was 18, his brother and friends, who had been involved in derbies for as long as he could remember, went out and got him his first derby car. A 73 Buick, and after that, he was hooked. Since then, he tries to do at least two derbies a year. His favorite cars to derby are 74 through 78 Dobas and 73 through 76 clamshells. And for those of you who don't know what a Doba or a clamshell are, a Doba is short for a Cordoba, which is a Chrysler, and clamshells are typically your GM wagons. Corey is part of the Paro Motorsports crew. Which consists of himself, his two brothers, his nephews, and his two sons. Good old family affair. When asked if he had any advice for the rookies, he said, Get a good helmet, a neck brace, strap it tight, and hold on. He also wishes everyone a good 2010 season and hopes to meet some good people along the way. As do we. Indeed we do. And that's about all the time we have. All right, well nice work, Corey. Now back to you guys. Now fill that up in derby car! Sorry. Oh, 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 nice piece, sir. That's right. Hey, Corey and you know your two kids, Corey and Evan. Kick some ass this year, huh? So let's go see what Mike's got going on, eh? No, I don't want to talk about Mike. You know he's the fastest guy in the whole wide world. Okay, Herbert, then let's talk about your derby debut this nice. month. I'm totally psyched about it. I got pretty much everything done, uh, just a few things to iron out. Well, that's kind of ironic. You got some ironing to do because uh, you only got about a week left. You know, you're right, that is ironic. But I'll totally be there. That's I mean, my derby I'm arm, man. Yeah, you'll be okay. Yeah. And so, uh, yeah, by the way, Sarah, you know, I'm gonna see you in the arena. Uh, <laughs> so you better watch out, sister. And so, anyways, after the show, uh, Monster Truck Entertainment, they're going to be taking their tour and traveling uh, just on up the road to Redmond, Oregon. It's going to happen pretty soon. Oh, yeah. So all you derbiers, keep an eye out for that. All right. And uh, the derby portion of the show is going to be managed by Dutch Holland uh, Racing Promotions. That's right. Get all the rules that you need at DutchHollandRacingPromotions.net. Very nice. And on our website, we went ahead and put a link to their site. 
But tell you what, on that note, let's get the hell on out of here, huh? You know what, before we do, let's go ahead and talk about the uh, July 24th theory. That's right, Southern Oregon Speedway! BAM! Wah! 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 Let's start getting registered, people. And let's not wait till the last minute to do that either. That's right. You can get the rules and the registration information at bbddn.com. Yeah, and remember, this derby is actually open up to all years of years. True, but not any type. Read the rules! That's right. Oh, and the answer is going to be no. You cannot weld the trunk of your car. <laughs> Period. <laughs> it's just that simple. It is that simple. F and A, Herb. F and A. So let's get the F on out of here! All right, well, thanks for tuning in. So until next time, build that derby car! <laughs>